Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, today we have another video and we are going to review the Fabian card. Uh, this is a foot fantasy card, 4 star, 4 star skill move. Currently he is somewhere around 320k I guess and um, he's also a good investment um, because he is in PSG, they're probably going to win their next domestic games. If he gets like 2 goals or 2 assists then the rating would increase further. So um, he would probably go up to like 90 or 91 is what I'm thinking and um, his price is going to rise too. Uh, he's 6'2", medium medium work rate, uh, left footed player and he can play center mid as well as CDM is what I believe, yep. And uh, attribute wise he's pretty good, he's 81 pace overall, the spin speed is a little less but you know you put a shadow on him. So I'd be playing him like... Um, center defensive mid but at the same time he'd be on the kind of like on the wing so he, he could be going a little bit on the front and then playing major role in defending uh, pretty much like a box to box how i use pogba but um, pogba will be my main central defender in this case and he'll be taking his place um, with shadow he has pretty good defending uh, his physicals are fine not something really uh, out of the charts but with his height I think the physical get boosted just in general. Um, another thing to notice is that he's not a lengthy type, not like Pogba, uh, if you're comparing him to someone. Uh, but still, I think he can perform pretty good in game given his pace and his defending are high. His dribbling stats really look good, agility is great, balance is a little low, but then uh, the core dribbling stat along with the ball control, reaction, and composure, uh, they all look good. So uh, let's find out how he plays in game. Oh, here is the lineup for the host. Let's see, man. Yeah, his dribbling looks okay. Not bad at all. Definitely, you could see um, his height coming into play. So even though it's smooth because of his height, his he he sometimes might look a little clunky, but very much manageable. Okay, let's see if he can take the run. Oh, is it off? Oh, it's not. And great finish by Fabio. So I triggered the run there. Uh, it wasn't that he was taking the run by himself. But then, great timing and a good finish. We're actually using him as a uh, central defensive mid, so I do not expect him to score a lot of goals. But these are the chances when we really need our midfielders to take, right? Good control there. And what a ball. Oh, the ghost could not take the chance, unlike him. But a uh, very good pass by Fabian. Well, the stats show us that the hosts haven't had that much of the ball. But what they've done with it has been really good. And be That's a very good pass again. We do get the goal this time. His passing and dribbling are really good. And defensing capabilities are very nice, but if he was lengthy, he would have been at another level. But still, he he's performing really nice for me. That's a good tackle. Just position him well. He did the rest. Yeah, even though he's not lengthy, sometimes his dribbling that, you know, the burst of pace that he shows is pretty much like a lengthy player and that's probably because of his height. Nicely done there. Nicely done there again. He turns. It's not like he turns after taking a lot of time, just because of his body type it seems that he's taking time in turning, but he, he's doing that pretty quick. Nice tracking back there by Fabian, I, I wasn't calling him back at his position but he did it by himself. That's a great tackle again. 
so solid out there, fans, as well. Some of their approach players being excellent. Well, opting for the short corner. Fabian. Now, this can be productive. Oh, that was such a good try by Fabian. Unlucky. Solid shooting. Alonso. Oh, no interception there, well, that's but an important that's okay. And Fabian. Good strength. Look at that pace. Ah. Oh. Should have probably cut inside, but that's a good burst to face there. Yeah, look at this dribbling. <clears throat> Pretty responsive, right? I don't know. It's just sometimes while turning, he might feel a little clunky, but other than that, it's pretty good. That's a great ball again. And finish. Good try. I thought the defender would block that. And there's the delivery. There it is, and just behind. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Nice pass there in the pressure. But it could run onto it here. Fabian. Oh, this is looking promising. Oh, oh nice. We got the ball back. I don't know what we did there. Look at that pace. Still going. Still going. And pretty a good cross. Oh, that was such a good play by Fabian. And why didn't he finish that? We're lost. Such a sweet finish again. This is the second game he's scoring for us. He doesn't miss a lot of chances, you know. His, his shooting doesn't look bad at all. It was actually a very good turn. Very quick. Again, a very good tackle by Fabian. Initiating the attack there. And we will have... Another thing that I like about this player is that he does... Oh, very good tackle there again. But he does pretty well in tight situations, you know. Where there's little space to pass, it would usually go accurate. So much pressure he deals with it so easily. Yeah, always there on the support, changing his position, trying to go for a run and coming back. Like like that about him. And what a pass. Look at that. I mean, wonderful pass. Very good tackle again. Ah, oh, didn't pick the right man. Again, it was a very good pass by Fabian. Very good tackle again. Ah, under pressure. Look at that. Getting past him easily. Good try. Yet again, he takes the ball. And he's there again. I mean, this match is just, he's been so, so good. So hard to take the ball off him, you know. That's probably because of his strength. But uh, his control looks very nice. I mean, I was just trying to take a long shot there. Yeah, Jockey, Jockey's pretty good. 
too. I mean, you know, little clunky when he turns. It's just a little, little clunky, but that's easily manageable with what he's providing in the game. Five minutes to go, and teammates around him. Another good ball. His passes are so accurate. I'm gonna. T I'm, I'm telling you that. Yeah, he was literally the man of the match, uh, you know. I was six rating, one goal and two assists, you know. Everything in this game that happened was literally, he was the core of it. Perfect finisher, he's got a great shot at him, his movement is excellent, and in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. I see him, but I, I don't know why that was a foul. The technique, but he just can't get it down in time. Good burst of pace there, Fabian. Fabian. Yeah, Arwen dribbling with him is not that responsive, but. That's a great really tackle. The lead at some point. They're really looking dangerous at the moment. Must be terrific save. <laughs> oh, he's given it. Penalty. And an opportunity now for them to Let's try this front. with Fabian. This to make it 1-0. A goal! Why not in the centre? Nicely done by Fabian there. Well, half time. Very good pass. Shortly, and the home side on top, Stuart. And he takes on the shot. Oh, why not? It was a good shoot as well. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Again, a very good tackle. Back with Forlan. And there's Fabian. Good goal by Fabian. Yet again, Fabian with two goals in this match, and one of them was very crucial. Pretty good performance. Pass and Very good pass by him again. We get the goal. It, it was all started by Fabian. So guys, final verdict on Fabian card. 4 star, 4 star. He's almost like Pogba but without 5 star skills. He's very strong on the ball, great dribbling. His pace is considerably noticeable uh, when you put a shadow. So uh, definitely Shadow is the chemistry style you should put on him. His his dribbling looks really solid. He's very solid on the ball. The only thing I've noticed is sometimes while turning he's a little clunky and that's because of his height, but it's very manageable. Um, I think he's a perfect player if you want to play someone box to box because the shooting is also wonderful. We've tried long shots with him. He has finished so many times. Uh, he's not only defending, uh, he's not only defended good for us, but he's also scored uh, so many goals and uh, also have assisted so many goals. So uh, definitely wonderful player to have. Uh, I think uh, for the investment as well, he's probably going to go two or three up and he's going to be even better. So I think if you have around 350, 330k uh, and you need someone who is just like Pogba or he's a very strong midfielder who can play both, who can kind of go forward and come back in the defense as well, he's a perfect player for you. Uh, hopefully you liked this video. If you did, please like, share and subscribe. We'll be back soon with another player review. Cheers.